Hey guys, what's up? It's me, Mr. Vopix, back here with another random Wednesday uh, Pokemon opening. And today I have uh, my. I'm gonna continue my Dollar Tree hunt for um, good pools. And today, last video I did of this was the Necrozma 15 opening 15 Necrozma uh, packs. And today I'm gonna do Ho Oh. And I'm going to open 15 of them and see if the pools are with me. Um, let's get to it. And hopefully there is something good. If not, I just wasted a lot of money. So there goes Guzma, Panport, and Alolan Rattatat. So the Guzma is good. Second pack is... Gonna be hard to open. But anyways. Here we have a Marlow. A Caterpie. And a Porygon 2. I don't think I have that one yet. So that's good. Here I have another. My third one. So the last Necrozma packs. The 15... I did not get anything good, but hopefully this proves me wrong. Raulu, Cutie Fly, and an Electric. So nothing good in that one either. Who knows? I might go get some more Pokemon cards from the Dollar Tree store because uh, when I did go get them, the Guardians Rising ones. I did uh, get a Hyper Rare um, Turtonator. And that's a Arachnoid Rare non hollow And a Rhydon. So. At least we got a Rare. Come on, Pools. Be with me. Don't steer me wrong. Ho oh. Here we have Tangela. Stu Piter and uh, or whatever her name is because I cannot pronounce it. But anyways, guys, here's my fourth or fifth pack. I don't know. I lost count already. But hopefully we can get something good. Come on, Hyper Rares. Let's go. Or Full Art. If I could get a Full Art Kiawe. Is Kiawe on this one? I don't know. But anyways, Tynamo, Dabbing Dusko, and another Electric. So nothing good yet, except that Guzma. But it's not full art, so it don't even matter. But it's still a Guzma. Oh no, I tore the pack. I was going to preserve these packs. But I'm doing a terrible, terrible job. We have an Inke, a Routes, and a Porygon 2. Come on, not even one reverse, common, or rare, or uncommon. Come on, I'm almost done with these guys. Get out. Haha, <laughs> I was having a battle with that pack. Hoodoot, an Alolan Vulpix, and a Curlia. So we got a Vulpix, so that's another good card. And how many more do we have left? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven more packs to go. Well, it's going to be six now, but anyways. Hopefully, something good comes out of it. We have a Meowth in Greece. Uh, beware, rare, and a curlia. Uh, so far, nada. And we have a Riolu, Cutie Fly, and a Sub Viper. I kind of miss. All of Jesse's old Pokemon, they should bring them back. So Viper, Dust Tox, Ekans, Arbok. I 
I kind of miss Mime Jr. from James's party. Noibat, Stuffle, and Electabuzz. Three, four packs left, guys. Four packs left. Hopefully, these weren't odd duds. Because, you know, I wasted $70. Ooh, we got a Pikachu right here, an Electivire, and a Rhydon. The Electivire is a rare, but it's a non hollow so sad. And we down to our second to last pack, I think. Nope, our third to last pack. And we have a Stuffle. Crowd Brawler and a Charmeleon. Ooh. Sweating bullets over here because I know that we're not going to get anything good. But there's a Crowd Brawler. Tangrowth Rare. Right? Yep. Rare, but it's non hollow. And a Bufflant. Our last pack of the day. Come on. Come on. Last pack, magic. Let's get to it and see what we could get. We have a Mudbray. A reverse Krogunk. So we finally got a reverse. And an electric. So the pools were not with us. The only good cards we got are Vulpix and Guzma. But the really, really only good cards we got was Guzma. Because Vulpix isn't considered much. But for me, Vulpix is everything. So, thank you for watching this video. Uh, like, subscribe, and comment down below. And tell me what, were your, what was your favorite card of the day. And um, do you guys really think these Dollar Tree packs are worth it? Or are they like not worth it at all? Let me know down in the descriptions, or not comments down below. And I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.